Well, guys, uh, it started sometime early this morning, earlier about 10 or 9 or 10, somewhere around there, sleeting. We got probably an inch of sleeting. Now it's snowing. They say it's supposed to keep this up till nightfall. We're supposed to get anywhere from 4 to 6 inches of snow. By, by nightfall, or, or at least by 8 o'clock anyway, or maybe later than that, I don't, I, I don't forgot now how late they said it was going to do this, but uh, we're going to get a pretty good accumulation, and uh, it's, it's snowing pretty good out here, pretty cold. I'm in the back part of my apartment, and uh, I'm kind of staying warm back there. I got it closed off to the rest of the house. The rest of the apartment. There's a few people out driving up and down the road. You can drive on snow. <laughs> I'm gonna try to stay in today. I ain't gonna go out. I don't expect I'm doing hunting today. But we're getting that winter weather stuff, like you do guys up north. So we probably won't get no hunting done today. So. I thought I'd show y'all a little video, do y'all a little video of the snow anyway. And, you know, and appreciate all your comments and all your kind words. And I, I, I least love each and every one of my, my subscribers and uh, appreciate you, you supporting me and, and all that. I like five more having a thousand guys and I sure do thank you for uh, thinking my videos are, are good. Well. Here lately, I've had trouble with my camera. I think it just needs to be cleaned up. And we're going to try to get something done about it. Uh, but anyway, uh, maybe by next weekend I'll have a, a better video for you. I think I got a guy that's, uh, somebody's supposed to be sending me a camera. At a little, uh, well, anyways. But uh, thanks for that. But, uh, we, I thought they gonna. I'm maybe I have better video next week. I'll get back with y'all later. See y'all later. Bye. Dave and Shelly, is this what it looks like snowing up there in Illinois? Man, you talking about it's doing some snowing here? Check it out. All this white stuff on the ground here in Hope, Arkansas. Man, it's coming on down. We're going to get some snow tonight. We'll get back with y'all later. Well, it's coming down heavier now. And uh, there's still cars up and down the street. I guess they're trying to keep the roads beat down. But uh, We were out driving on it. Coming down pretty good. You guys, I had something since we're taking a break from metal detecting today. I thought I'd run something by you. Uh, I've been working in Tyson now for almost 10 years. February 5th will be my anniversary date. I have 10 years in. And uh, over the years that I've been working, I've taken advantage of that and, and uh, learned a lot of Spanish. And I, I can speak a lot of Spanish now because of it. Well, here's the deal. Uh, my health... I've got a bad left ankle, and it's uh, it stays swollen all the time. And uh, I've had an operation on it. And being that I've learned so much Spanish, I've got some friends, a lot of uh, Latino friends. And uh, I have been down to central Mexico and been down there when there was a lot of fiestas, going, parties, you know, fiestas going on. And, and been to some beautiful historic cities. And I know all the places that you can stay, good places to eat, you know. And uh, here's my proposal. I'm hoping that uh, I would like to get started a tour down there, taking people to Mexico. You know, there's uh, there's uh, tourist tourist cities that you can go to, like Cancun and uh, Puerto Vallarta and and uh, Acapulco and places like that. But uh, there's other not real beautiful places that people don't know about that I do know about. And uh, when all different seasons of the year, 
that are best for going down there to see all the different fiestas and parties, you know, and festivals and all that that are taking place. And uh, I have contacts down there now so that I can get back with, you know, and, and talk to people, you know, and, and uh, all that. So, uh, you know, that, uh, that could, like, carry us around, you know, and translate for me, you know, and, and I could translate, I mean, translate for you, you know, and all that, I can, you know, but I can talk to them, and, and uh, they can take us around to all the beautiful places, you know, and so that's uh, just something I'm thinking about doing, because uh, eventually I can't work in Tyson forever, and uh, so I thought I'd run that by y'all and see what y'all thought, you know, I'm a, uh, yeah, I, that's what I want to do. I want to get into having my own tour to Mexico. Of course, right now you haven't. We're having. They're having trouble at the borders, you know, and and uh, we couldn't go right this very minute. We're gonna have to wait until that kind of settles down a little bit. Things get better, but hopefully for it won't last forever, you know. But that's something I'm wanting to do eventually. Is getting into taking people to you know, on tours to Mexico to different cities and there's a lot of historic historic cities, beautiful cities. And I know where they're where they are and all the different sites and all that. And uh, I got a lot of friends that live down there in central Mexico and that can help me out, you know, so I, I put into it pretty good, you know, and spent some time down there and I know the people down there now, especially in this one little town. So uh I'm hoping to get into that eventually, so uh, give me your feedback on that. See what you think, you know. Tell me what you think about it, and uh, I I'll get back with y'all later. Guys, I'm in my apartment, and I'm showing you a picture outside the window of my back bedroom. You see out there how much snow we're getting on the ground? It's covered, and that snow is still coming down hard. And we got several more wires yet to go. Look how that, that when clouds are dark up there. And that snow is coming down hard. We're going to get quite a bit of accumulation on the ground. Look how much is already on the ground now. I'm going to go out front here in a minute and give you a picture out there. Get back in a little bit. Guys, look here. This is the front part of the house. Apartment. I mean, look at the snow on the ground. Snow is coming down now. There's cars up and down the street, but it won't be long. Come nightfall, and that, when this thing starts slowing down, them streets will start getting slick. And it's dark up there in the sky. But we're going we still gonna get a lot of snow yet. Quite a bit of accumulation on my truck. Man, ain't this something. We ain't had a snowfall like this in southwest Arkansas in a long time. Look at that bird up there. I don't know what he's doing. Got a bird up there flying around that stuff. Anyway, I'm throwing together a little video for you guys up north. It's snowed in up there. Okay, this is this is kind of different down here in the south. We, don't, we haven't had a hard snow like this in... In many years, so we would we would do one, okay. So anyway, we'll we'll get through it, yeah. and we may get some more before the year's out. But you know, before winter's out, I mean. But anyway, man, that stuff, wind blowing, blowing it on top of me and camera and everything. Anyway, I'll get back with y'all later. Oh, I want to remind y'all, I've been to put up, throw up some pictures of some places that I've been to in Mexico and things I've done and places I've eaten, places of interest, you know, uh, historic places. And uh, and there's some restaurants, you know, that I've ate in, some nice restaurants I've ate in, and, uh, and some fiestas that I've been to. And I hope you enjoy the pictures. So I'll get back with y'all later.
really big clue with an attitude.